The first type of electronic music I listened to was probably All Tekka when Carvers Tarabi played it on the show and I thought that's different, that's weird. Then we had another artist from, if you could call it the proggy world, you know, a different type of music world, because prog's an old genre in a way, um, who, who came along and played some Boards of Canada and some Aphex Twin and I thought this is quite interesting stuff, why have I not listened to it before? Um, and then obviously seeking out more artists of the, the All Tekka style, 106 Point Never and, and things like that. Seeking out the good ones is part of the fun of it. Uh, and watching Surgeon last night hold the dance floor and hold everybody's attention for an hour and a half was astonishing. So watching techno in the right environment is essential. You can't listen necessarily to techno at home. Come and watch it live. Come and listen to the experience live. Different story. A lot of the music that we play on our radio show, it comes from a variety of sources. Obviously the electronic stuff, it's out there now, there's plenty of opportunities. You get take something like Floating Points, who have sort of crossed over into the electronic scene, but they're also, they're a band as well, you know, they're, they're more band-like than electronic-like. Um, so that, that thing I think is quite well catered for. I can go to Phonica in London or go on bleak.com, you know, those places and get recommendations and listen to stuff because it's out there now, you just have to click on a file and, and yeah, I like that, buy it, click, done. The same can be said for other styles of music, you just got to know where to go. And I think you just follow your, follow your nose and if you're prepared to do the leg work or the mouse work now, you've got a chance to find decent music. But I've got my foot in a few different pies, um, so therefore we, we know some great music that's outside of this particular genre as well that would still appeal. I'm not sure that I, I have a career in DJing. I mean, like, that's just, that, that would be too far. But we have been invited to do a few uh, DJing spots. We do one in a brewery in, in uh, Bethel Green called the Red Church Brewery. We've done that bi-monthly. Honestly, come and drink brilliant beer and listen to some weird messed up music. Not necessarily all electronic, but just a weird mixture. That's been great fun. We've done that bi-monthly for the last six months now, and that's going to continue. But also, I think it's sort of official, and it's not, no big deal, but there's a really great place in London for different styles of music called Cafe Otto. And I think we're going to do a DJ night there. So, you know, if every now and again, forward-thinking, strange music places go, well, we we'll have, yeah, we have other people there, why not have Steve and Carvus playing their funny music, then great, bring it on.